Hello guys, Jake here. Welcome back to another video. Today I've got for you another shots vlog as all shot take on Hartlepool on non-league day. So guys, it's been quite a while since my last video. In that time, Aldershot have played four league games. First one was against Yeovil and that resulted in a 3-1 loss. Next, we played Chesterfield and that resulted in a 2-1 loss. Game after that, we played Chorley and that resulted in a 0-0 draw. And our fourth and final game was against Dover in midweek and that resulted in a huge 4-0 win. Another thing that's happened since my last video, we've brought in a new striker by the name of Mo Betemer. He has played a few games already. I'm pretty sure he started in the 4-0 win against Dover. And in that 4-0 win, Shamir Mullings also bagged his first goal for the club. So let's hope he can build on that and uh, all shot as a team can build on that going into today's game. And our opponents for the game today are Hartlepool United, currently sitting in 16th, two places above all shot who are sitting in 18th. And a big thing to note with Hartlepool, in the last couple of days, they have sacked their manager, Craig Hickner, and I don't think they've brought in a new one. So I'm not sure who's their kind of caretaker at the minute, but hopefully we can maybe use that to our advantage. And obviously we've got that great momentum from Tuesday night. And I think they've actually lost their last game. So yeah, I'm really hoping for a good result today, feeling confident. I'm going to go with a 2-0 win to the shots and hopefully that can boost us even further away from the relegation zone. But yeah, hopefully you guys do enjoy the video. If you do, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you are new around here. And let's go to the game. This is the Ed Stadium, the home of the shots. Please welcome onto the pitch the match officials and the players of Hartlepool United and Aldershot Town! Thank you. 
more good than that was. Alright guys, so half time, all the shot nil, Hartlepool won and both teams have had penalty shouts, all the shots uh, wasn't given and then Hartlepool went straight up the other end and slotted at home uh, in around the fourth minute and then Hartlepool had a penalty shout and that was given but luckily Mitch Walker came in with a big save and we've had a lot of chances, we've been playing pretty well and hopefully if we continue that into the second half we can get a goal or two, let's see.
Thank you. 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 time all the shot nil hartley pull three and that was not a good performance especially in the second half first half i thought we played pretty well we should have uh, at least probably scored one we had a few easy chances but just couldn't finish it and hartley pull uh, obviously got the goal from a penalty call from us which uh, the referee didn't get and then their penalty call he awarded mitch walker with the brilliant save and then in the second half it kind of just all fell apart, especially towards the last 10 minutes where they scored uh, their second and their third goal. So obviously their manager being sacked hasn't really made a difference and their caretaker, maybe after that win, if he can carry that on, he could be appointed permanently. But I think we really do need to improve and obviously next week we've got Bromley away in the FA Cup and they're doing really well. They're in second place at the minute. So that's once again going to be a really hard game, but I will be going to it. So yeah, Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you are new around here, share this video with your friends, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.